Komm in den totgesagten Park. People say this park is dead, allowed to run to seed, deserted. Yet see how sweet a shimmer moves along the shore. The peaceful blue and white expansive sky shines on pathways, silvers the still surface of the pond, a vacant eye. <clears throat> Grey and black the birch, the box a burning yellow, unflickering flame, the breeze as mellow as an aging thought. Late roses linger, brush them with your lips and sense their softness. The purple intertwining wilding vine, asters recalling forgotten memories. The lasting green of the lawns outlives summer's burning, browning at the edges into autumn. Die Herden trabten. Herds came wandering from their winter holts the worst of the weather over. The wakeful herdsman shook himself and rose, stretched his limbs, shivered with delight, feeling the sap surge through muscle and bone. He made his way through greening water meadows as light flooded the fields and ran and flashed up mountain flanks upon the far horizon, and lit the sparkling peaks with morning fire. Crossing the ford, he squatted, cupped his hands, drank in panting gulps the cold, clear water from the heights above, fingered fragile shells that seemed the symbols of his happiness, wandered into the wood, the frosty glen where forthright waterfalls plunged between black boulders, pendant mosses dripped and beech roots coiled among the debris. <coughs> Speaking silence whispered through the canopy above him. He rested by running water in the noon, lying on sun-warmed grass. Silver scales of leaping fishes flashed the swollen streamlet. In the afternoon he climbed the peak, prayed and crowned himself with holy leaves. Shadows of clouds passed over him, journeying hosts. He sang his sacred songs upon the height. <clears throat>